Hey everyone, Mike Sherry back at Paul Sherry RVs. Today I'm showing you a brand new floor plan by Keystone Bullet. And it's really, it's really got a lot to show you and I'm excited to show this to you. I'm gonna flip this around and we'll take a look at it. This is all the, the all new 2021 and a half, which is what the 2022s are gonna look like. They call this, this the Keystone Bullet Crossfire. This is the 2430 bunkhouse now this is the same floor plan as their most popular bullet which is the 243 bhs and what they've done is they've offered this trailer to us dealers the 2430 at a discount and that's amazing because i haven't seen a discount in rv since really covid started and uh everyone really saw how cool it was to travel in an rv and a social distancing world so it's awesome to get a discount and i'm excited to show this trailer to you did to you today and maybe just maybe if this floor plan suits you you might be able to take advantage of the discount so this is the all new keystone bullet weighs right at to the dot five thousand pounds so this can be towed by some uh suvs out in the market i would say just about most if not all half ton pickup trucks are going to be able to tow this uh, there might be a few odd numbers out there but it can be towed by many things is what i'm trying to say power tongue jack comes standard Two propane bottles will be filled here by the dealership. Uh, some call that prep, some dealers do. We just call it part of the sale. Uh, this also has power uh, landing gear, which you control right here. And by landing gear, I mean these stabilizing jacks right here. The Lippert stabilizing jacks. What you do, you, you push those buttons until these jacks come down, they touch the ground, and that's gonna keep this trailer from rocking back and forth when people are moving around inside the trailer. Nice, big, expansive, uh, storage compartment going all the way through to the other side this is an eight foot wide trailer uh, it does have uh, the aluminum construction that's how they're able to get this big of a trailer that lightweight it does come with one super slide with the dinettes in i'll show you that when we get inside and a lot of times when manufacturers offer a discount you're thinking okay they took a bunch of stuff out of this that got the price down right they really did it in this still had the black tank flush which is a premium option uh it still has the outside shower with hot and cold water two axles on this okay your dump station down here the underbelly is even insulated so it's insulated and heated underbelly uh, coming around to the rear does come with the spare tire has the rounded roof up there that's going to keep the rainwater off uh led lighting on the tail lights back here it's got this really cool spot here and i probably eh, might be able to get it open with one hand so this is going to have a spot where you can through this panel then where you can put your uh dump hose right in there so there's always a need for okay where am i going to put my dump hose and it's nice having that spot right there spare tire comes with it it's got a couple ports back here. One's a spray port, which is gonna come with a hose and a nozzle, so you can spray off uh, maybe your feet, things of that sort. Also has a propane port back here for a, a, a gas grill. Uh, now the roof is walkable up there. It has this really nice outside, I don't wanna call it a kitchen, I wanna call it more just an outside beverage center maybe. It's got a refrigerator here, a little storage cabby here, and then a pull-out uh, countertop here for, you know, prep station. You can have your grill off to the side here, uh, and you can kind of prep it here. You've got water through the water port there if you need to clean up. Uh, so you can kind of make your own outside kitchen with this one. It does have power as well uh, right here. So if you want to put maybe a blender or something up there, uh, you sure can, surely can do that. Outside speakers, nice outside speakers. Uh, has the new water heater here. And uh, right here, there's a, a mount uh, or a backing here uh, for a TV bracket. Uh, again, this is all new 2430BH Keystone Bullet Crossfire. All right, as so we walk in, has the Keystone Bullet interior, which is the uh, white cabinets. I love them. Absolutely love them. In the slide here, we have the oversized U dinette. See a lot of people there. Coming and looking at the kitchen, a good amount of countertop space. Television's going to mount right on the wall right here. Uh, the countertop is a seamless countertop, so you don't get the edges on it uh, that like to pop off on you. That also allows them to do this big sunk-in stainless steel sink. And uh, three burners up here on the range top. 
and up and down below. Several drawers here. Full depth drawers too, you notice, so you can get all the way to the back of the drawer. And then some storage down here. Big spot here, you could easily put a trash can down underneath the sink there. Uh, it's got the six cubic foot dual mode RV refrigerator and freezer. Freezer is the portion I just showed you up top. Refrigerator is down below here. Has the nice uh, Furion, all Furion appliances other than the refrigerator, so I like that they match. Uh, microwave, a range hood, and oven are all Furion. Uh, double bunks back here. Uh, it does have little cubbies back in the corner of the bunks, and also that black box there is a USB charging port. Uh, now the bottom bunk's the same size, uh, has a nice mattress on it. Good thickness to the mattress here, so it's going to be comfortable sleeping on these. I'm six foot tall and I can fit in them, to give you an idea. Um, now if you're like six foot five, I think you're going to be a little cramped in here. Um, it does have lights, and then this bottom bunk, see if I can do this, yeah. So this folds up, and you can put like bicycles in here. Uh, you could probably maybe fit a canoe uh, or a kayak along the floor here if you wanted to. Uh, anyone that figures out how to do that, let me know how. All right, bathrooms in its own area. Right here, it's all in one. has the tub. It's the deep tub, too. I haven't seen that in a lot of brands uh, as of late. It does have the shower here. It's got the vent with the fan in it. And uh, it's got a, little, a couple little storage areas here. Um, storage underneath the sink. You can put some toilet paper down in there. And then it does have the medicine cabinet here that's mirrored. And I just absolutely love this wood. Uh, you know, I've seen other white wood. It's almost got like a flat paint finish. This is more smooth. Uh, so it's going to be easy to keep clean. I, I kind of like things clean myself. All right. So coming out of there, right outside the bathroom, you have your pantry here, which is uh, either a pantry or you can take out the shelves, the removable shelves right here. And it has a hanging rod already there. So I, I like dual purpose things. Uh, it does come with the radio that's going to play on those outside speakers. There's also two speakers inside here as well. This is Bluetooth, AM, FM. I think it, it's got everything but the 8-track, right? It's got the USB port, the HDMI port right next to it, and even an auxiliary port there. Coming into the, the bedroom here. So the bedroom does have solid doors for privacy. Uh, and then you're going to have your queen bed here. And I absolutely love how they did this bedroom. Is you can walk around all three sides of the bed. Even the foot of the bed. Which sometimes can be an issue. So I like having this room at the foot of the bed. Not only to walk around. Which there's plenty of room to walk around here. But also if you're a little taller. You're not feeling so constricted with the wall right there. Uh, it does have a hanging closet here and then i love how they did the just the extra piece here they added the drawer down there and then this is even extra special this is a laundry hamper right here that goes to the outside storage compartment i showed you at the beginning and then kind of at the head of the bed there's little cubbies here uh for storage you can put your phones and things at the end of the day and then there's going to be charging ports on the but there's electric on one side and then there's usb and electric on this side so you can charge your devices really easy all right, so I hope you like this uh, Keystone Bullet. This is the 2430 uh, uh, BH. I, I like it. I love a discount. And if this is in your in your floor plan, in your way, in your desires for an RV, keep this at the top of your list. You're going to get a lot of value on this Keystone Bullet uh, just from doing this every day. This is a deal. So if you're in for a deal, check it out. Thanks for watching.